Liquid on top all day long. That's all it is. I shoot a nigga if he take me Yo, what it do, YouTube, man? I know it's late. I know it's late. I gotta get this video out for y'all, though, man. Listen, that's how much dedication I got to hit the 10K. Man, we right there. We at 7.5. All I need to do is suck. Sup? And comment down below if you like the overlay or not. You see the overlay? You got the spam one on Twitter, spam one on YouTube, spam one on TikTok, spam Ryan one on Instagram, man. Follow me on all those four if you want, man. You know what I'm saying? Just do it. And then Twitch, you spam one. All the links in the on the bio. You know what I'm saying? So listen, just all I need you to do is comment down below if you like the overlay a lot or not. You know what I'm saying? A lot of people said it's too much. Some people said it's not too much. But yeah, all right, let's get into this video, man. I know y'all see this level though. Level 18, I'm trying to get these mascots, man. Listen, also, this, this is what I need you to comment right now. What's your favorite 2K mascot, man? You know what I'm saying? NBA mascot, let me know. You know what I'm saying? And whoever gets the most comments, I will buy the mascot, man. I know it, it looks like I'm far, I'm level 18. We're gonna be there next time I make a YouTube video, honestly, honestly. And then I'm gonna go on P5 and try to do the same thing. But yeah, comment down below what your favorite mascot is. Comment down below if y'all like the overlay. That's all I need you to do. But all right, I've been talking a lot. Time to get into this video. All right, so basically, man, we're gonna talk about shooting tips. But first off, I gotta give you my jump shot, man. You know what I'm saying? A lot of people ask for my jump shot. I gotta give it to you, man. I gotta give it to you, man. Hold on. Let me just, all right. So first of all, you need base three. Now listen, listen. Base three, jump shot three, whatever you wanna call it, is the best jump shot in the game. It literally gives you the best form while it's being the most quickest. You know what I'm saying? It gets the, it gets the shot off quick. So there's no contest. But listen though, like in my last jump shot video, it did really well. It got like 30k views. Set shot 25 is also a glitch, man. You know what I'm saying? I'm not gonna tell y'all about the set shot 25. If you wanna watch the set shot 25 video, go to the other video. But this one is about the jump shot I use right now, right? So let's start off with jump shot, jump shot um three. You know what I'm saying? I really like jump shot three. It's hard, it's, it's hard to time set shot 25, but if you can time it, bro, you can be a D. I'm gonna be honest. But all right, release one, Rudy Gay. Now listen, for all the people that watch me and know about me, do you know what the next release is? But let me talk about Rudy Gay for a second, man. Rudy Gay is easy to like, you know what I'm saying? Like when he's shooting, you can see it and you know when to release the X button to shoot or extra square, whatever you wanna call it, to shoot. You know what I'm saying? So if you can see the form, it makes it a lot easier for you to shoot. I'm just gonna be honest with you. And before I give you the second release, listen, bro. If you want to be really good at shooting, you got to be able to keep the same jump shot over and over. I don't care if it's 50. Now, if it looks ugly, that's the only way That's the only way you want to go to another jump shot. If it looks ugly and not comfortable with it, you know what I'm saying? But if you're just bricking and it looks clean, you're like, ah, I'm not, I swear I'm trying to write. Keep shooting with it, bro. You know what I'm saying? That's what you got to do. You perfect the jump shot like it's nothing, bro. I promise you. Like, all you got to do, perfect the jump shot, bro. If you gotta go on the micro direct, whatever you gotta do, keep doing it. Now, Rudy Gay, I use this is for the second release. I use this on current gen and next gen, man. Both of them. I use it on both of them. And I can shoot pretty well on both. If you know, if you know, you know. You know what I'm saying? If you know, you know. If you come to my stream, you see I can shoot a little bit. Not the best shooter, but I can still shoot more better than 80, 90% of the players that play the game. You know what I'm saying? So that's why you listen to me. Blending, it doesn't matter. You can put it on 50, 100. Just make sure the release speed is on the max to the right. Make It could be anything. It could be 80, 20, it don't matter. You know what I'm saying? I already have the jump shot made, so that's it. Now, I'm going to go to the shooting badges, right? Actually, yeah, yeah, I'm going to go to the shooting badges, right? All right, so this is what I run. Now, I got Blinders Hoff. You got to have Blinders Hoff as the PG, man. I'm sorry. You got to have Blinders Hoff as a PG. Now, I'm not going to lie, if you're a power forward, you still need to use it lock. You still need to use it shooting guard. You still need to center. Obviously not. But yeah, Circus 3s, I feel like it's the most cheesiest badge in the game. You can bait. Now, you only should be using this if you're a point guard or shooting guard. That's why I have it on Hoff, though, because it's really OP when you get it on Hoff. You can shoot from farther. You just, you got to be confident when you shoot, too, man. You know what I'm saying? So, if you got these badges on and you're confident, you're going to become a better shooter, I promise you. Dead eye. Now, if I could get this on Hall of Fame, I would, right? I would, but I can't. So I'm putting on gold just so I can make the smokers. I'm gonna be honest. Like I know it's bad. I know it's bad, but I'm, I didn't make the game. I played the game. that's in front of me. So 
I make this mothers, man. I'm sorry. Green Machine on bronze. Now, I heard Green Machine on bronze and silver is no difference, and I'm not running higher than that. So I just put it on bronze. I'm going to be honest. Lucky seven. Sometimes I like to run fast breaks, so I come with the court green. Or I have Lucky seven on for breaks, man. You know what I'm saying? That's like two seconds, and it does pop up on the breaks. And I don't miss any break shots, to be honest. So that's where I run that. Set shooter, no one should use it. Not a point, not a point guard shooting around lock. Nothing. Nothing should use that. All right. So stop and pop, Hall of Fame. You need this on off, man. I'm telling you. Now you can go to gold if you want it. If you're a shooting guard and you need, like, you know what I'm saying, to move something. Move it on shooting guard or don't use this on lock. Don't use it on power for these guys. Sit For point guard, you should always have it on half shooting guard. You can slide with gold. You feel what I'm saying? Catch and shoot, not needed at all. I play shooting guard, not needed. Now, if you're a lock or power forward, use this. If you're a popper, use this. You feel what I'm saying? Use these. Clutch shooter, not needed. If you play threes, it's a little needed for point guards, but not really. It's difficult shots. Don't use this for anybody. Don't use it for no position. Nothing. Nothing. Nada. Hazel Hunter should be hard for every position. Point guard, shooting guard, lock, center, power forward. It can be any. Just have it on. I promise you. Have it on. Mismatch expert, my lock. My live goon, if you watch this video, he probably not. My friends are fake, I'm sorry. But goon, he uses mismatch and he shoots pretty well with this, man. He shoots right over the center with it. So that's the lock. Now, point guard or shooting guard should have this as high as it can be. High as it can be. The shooting guard, you can slide with gold or silver, to be honest. But point guard, you gotta have a hawk. You're gonna be the smallest player on the court, so you gotta have the highest amount of mismatch actually. So the slippery off ball, nothing. Don't use this. As center, you could use this, but use it on bronze at most. Volume shooter, don't use this on nothing, nothing. Not any position. Chef, Hall of Fame, I'm telling you, clean. On my shooting guard, I use it on silver though. And don't use this on any other position except point guard and shooting guard. And shooting guard, I have it on silver. Corner specialist, power forward, power forward and lock should have this. Power forward and lock should have this. Silver, silver is the perfect medium. I'm telling you, use it on silver. Perfect medium, bro. I'm telling you, you'll be able to shoot all this. And comment down below if you like these information videos. I'm coming with pro videos. I'm sorry. I'm, you know what I'm saying? No, I'm not sorry. You know what I'm saying? I'm not sorry. I'm trying to help you all out. What the heck am I apologizing for? But um, pro videos coming soon. It might be tomorrow. It might be the next day. Just, keep, just stay tuned. Now, face, fade ace, nothing. Don't use this on anything. You know what I'm saying? Don't even use it on your shit. I'm going to be honest. Limitless spotter. I don't use this as point guard, but shooting guard, Hall of Fame. Hall of Fame. You lock? Have it on silver. Have it on silver as lock. And for power forward, bronze. If you're a popper, have it on gold. Or Hall of Fame, if you're a popper. If you're a popper, that's it. Rhythm shooter, nobody. Nothing. No position should be using rhythm shooter. Sniper, Hall of Fame. Every position that can shoot. Every position. Point guard, Hall. Shooting guard, Hall. Power forward, Hall. Every, if you can get it on half, get it on half. Whatever the max is, put it at the max, man. You know what I'm saying? I don't want no comments like, what if I can't get it off? Get, put it on the max you can. You know what I'm saying? Put it on the max you can. Now, we got to go over one more thing, and then we can get out of here. You know what I'm saying? We get out of here. We're the class is out of session. Class out of session. Do pull up, Trey Young. You need this pull up. Now, if y'all want a tutorial on the Trey Young fade, I can comment them. Just comment down below, bro. I got you. Literally say, I need help on a Trey Young fade. And I got you. I got you. I got you, bro. All right. Um, spin jumper, normal. I don't even spin jump. I don't even do that. I don't even do that. So, hop jumper, Steph Curry. Now, let me tell you, all the dribblers, bro, clean. Shooting guards, clean. It, it literally is perfect, bro. You really can act like you're about to shoot it and fake it and fade to the left. Fade to the right. Literally, one of the cleanest moves ever. Um, I've tried Kyrie. It's a good dribble move. But scoring-wise, it's not really there. You know what I'm saying? So that's why I use Stephen Curry. I'm sorry that this video is so long. But, hey, I'm trying to get you better than me, to be honest, bro. I just, I'm just i just trying to make videos. I'm trying to make you better than me. You know what I'm saying? Not better than me. So at least same level. And shout out to Precise for, for posting that video against me, man. I'm going to post my point of view next. I'm going to be honest. That's probably going to be the next video I drop. But, yeah, man. By the way, the jump shot celebrations don't matter. I feel like it does low key, but it really doesn't. It's all about the mind. But if people ask me what's the best jump shot celebration, so I'm gonna tell y'all what it is. No look is definitely the best to me. After that, it's bunny hop. After bunny hop, it's desperado. After that, just 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 figure out whatever you want to do. But all right, man. Listen, man. Let's get this video over, with, man. Hold on, hey, man. Hope y'all enjoyed this video, man. Listen. 
I'm done with videos, man. Hey, be great. Stay great. Let's go on out. Let's get it. Peace.